Okay, here's a question we're asked to uh, simplify. <coughs> um, I don't think the threes are there originally. So on the top, I think you can factor a six out of each of those terms. And you always want to factor out a common factor first and as much as you can. <coughs> so it'll be y squared plus 2y minus uh, 6 and 48 goes 8. Over, on the bottom, you're right, you can factor out a 3. Left with y squared minus 3y plus 2. Okay, and then I guess I can cancel this 3. And 3 goes into 6 twice. So I'm left with 2 times y squared plus 2y minus 8 over y squared minus 3y plus 2. Now, each of these are trinomials, so I could factor them. So the top one, <coughs> I can split into y and y. Two numbers that multiply to a negative 8 and add to a positive 2, uh, like negative 4 and 2. Uh, note that adds to negative 2. 4 and negative 2, yeah, that multiplies to negative 8 and adds to positive 2. So I put a positive 4 there and a minus 2 there. Similarly on the bottom, two numbers that multiply to a positive 2, and they have to add to a negative 3. So 2 times 1, but that adds to a positive 3. How about negative 2 times negative 1? They multiply to 2, and they add to negative 3. Those are my numbers. So y minus 2, y minus 1. And now, here's a common factor there, so I can cancel those out. So I'm left with 2 times y plus 4 over y minus 1. Hopefully that helps you with that question.